Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. Today, find out how the price of IOTA has changed and what the technical indicators EMA, Divergence, Stochastic RSI and MACD show. If you are unfamiliar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos below. Looking at the IOTA hourly time frame, the price moved quickly to the downside with around 6.0% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 32.2 cents. The volume was also high showing that this move was strong and the sellers are taking over. Looking at the hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is below the hourly ribbon, which is generally bearish and the ribbon could play as a resistance, so it is to watch if the price will bounce off it or break it. The current price to watch is around 33.2 cents. The ribbon is spread out so the resistance should be strong. On the lookout for divergences in the hourly time frame, the price went up after the bullish divergence, but then came quickly down again. Looking at the hourly stochastic RSI, currently, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are very high, meaning that the crypto is being high light bought and a change in the trend can be expected or for it to remain at least stable for some time. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so you should wait to see if the trend will actually go down. Moving to the hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently strong and it could be expected the price to go further to the upside. Looking at the three hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is below the three hourly ribbon, which is generally bearish and the ribbon could play as a resistance, so it is to watch if the price will bounce off it or break it. The current price to watch is around 34.1 cents. The ribbon is relatively spread out so the resistance should be considered. Jumping to the three hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region, which means that the price is getting oversold and soon a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation could be expected. The trend has shifted upwards because the K line is currently located above the D line. Looking at the three hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the upside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate for some time and you should wait to see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. Moving to the daily exponential moving averages, the current price went below the daily ribbon, so you should wait to see if the price will jump back above the ribbon or it will act as a resistance to the upside which is at around 32.5 cents at the moment. Looking at the daily stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region, which means that the price is getting oversold and soon a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation could be expected. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so it should be waited to see if the trend will actually change to the upside. Jumping to the daily MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. We can expect for the price to continue going down or perhaps remain at least stable because the MACD histogram shows the momentum currently being strong. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time. time.